Welcome everyone to your intro video for the month of July 2017. Uh, welcome to the channel if you are new to all of the subscribers that have been here. Lots of love. Thanks for coming back and sending out your good vibes and love and comments and likes and shares. You know, it's very much appreciated and thanks for supporting for, let's see, the year and some change that I've been doing videos. Um, I've been doing tarot readings longer than that, but, you know, it's been a journey. It's been fun to discover different things and I'm still on the up and up. So, um, it will be interesting to see where it goes from here. So, um, I will be doing for each um, of these zodiac signs I'll be doing a little intro as to well not intro but pulling out um, theme energies like three cards as to what you may be experiencing and then we'll go into recent past events current energy obstacles advice as to what you may be dealing with now these are general in nature so you may want to go to your moon sign your rising sign video or your ascendant sign to see if those readings actually resonate with what you may be dealing with in love because there are 12 zodiac signs there are a lot of uh, people who have that particular zodiac sign but there are different personality traits that goes with that situation so there are different variations of you know what that person could be going through just because i say a a certain let's say um sagittarius may be going through this or acting this way not all of them are you know some may be a bit naughty at a certain time any sign and the other one is the good guy the good and the bad in your situation so there's always that um instance where you have to put yourself in the picture to see uh, which side of the coin you may be on at that time you know it's a exercise but you know because they are general that's something that you'll need to do to work with that particular reading if you would like a private reading where i tap into your specific energy and situation you can go to the website psychiclovehills.com uh, to purchase an option that will be uh, specific for you or you can email me to set up something uh, for your um, situation to try to clear some things up for you if we can all right so lots of love again healing vibes out to you i really do hope that you have a fantastic month of july and i just wanted to say hi say thanks and uh enjoy all right much love so sagittarius we're going to check out the theme energy for the month of july 2017 i love three cards for sagittarius july 2017 the three of swords uh this is heartbreak separation uh third party situation for some of you a lot of pain and suffering uh, with the mind uh, not being able to let something go uh truth coming to light um, let's see other energies here for uh, sagittarius three of cups reverse remember i was mentioning the three of uh, well, the three people that could be involved. You have the three of cups here, so there could be a third party situation that some of you are dealing with. Um, also, um, this is like staying away from a certain person or a situation after some kind of truth has been revealed um, in a marriage, in a relationship or something like that, and really not liking uh, that energy too much. Uh, let's see, and other energy for Sagittarius for July 2017. And you have temperance reversed uh this is your card sagittarius you could be dealing with another sag um that combustion of energy of fire and fire could be having a lot of uh, disappointments between you two depending on how you react to one another and um this is uh losing your patience you're cool losing your temper um being volatile if you feel provoked um if you're a bit impatient with a desired outcome and not liking it too much uh, the three of cups not only means a third party situation in reverse it can mean just uh overindulging you know drinking partying too much because of heartbreak or feeling a bit alone or isolated uh, by yourself you know that energy could be coming up so uh, this is the theme uh, around what's going on uh, for the month of july in love so Let's see uh, what's going on uh, with you for the recent past events coming from June. Recent past events for Sagittarius for uh, July 2017 in love. Recent past events for Sagittarius. We have death. Death is transformation, uh, change, 
definitely letting go of something that some of you have been holding on to um this could be see in generalized readings um the loss of someone you know that energy of experience and transition of, of a loved one and having to heal from that or relationship being divorced separated um heartbroken uh feeling uh, a bit destroyed by some kind of change that some of you are going through um in a relationship some of you could be dealing with a scorpio for some uh Recent past against Florida Sagittarius. The two of cups reverse breakup, like I was saying, uh, separation, uh, not being in agreement in generalized uh, energy uh, with family members, friends, your job, or something like that that could be going on um, in your love relationship or marriage. You know, some kind of separation happened for sure uh, for some of you. Sagittarius, what about that? And there's emotional healing, um, trying to do your best to heal over some wounds. These could be things that pop up from years and years ago. You know, these things could just overwhelm you uh, through healing. You know, different planets in astrology actually um, places a lot of uh, energy that comes out of nowhere, you know, uh, within us. So it just uh, depends on you know, what that might be for you. Uh, so let's see for... And then we do have the will of fortune in the um, upright position. So even in the midst of dealing with these things, you know, the reality of a certain situation, you do see in your reality that um, a lot of times these are karmic events that actually happen to free you, to have you move forward. Sometimes these are synchronicities that pop up around you to keep you open and realizing that beautiful things can happen to you and not only uh sometimes it's disastrous things that may feel that way but they're not it's to help you move forward and clear energy out so the will of fortune there is some good luck some good signs that may have been coming to you in the midst of all of this energy uh within the recent past okay so let's see uh energies as to current energies that you will be facing in uh, july 2017 for sagittarius July 2017, the two of swords reversed uh, indecision sometimes making a decision uh, for some of you uh, but sometimes this is being a bit uh, stuck in so many different directions and roles to take that you could could be a bit confused at times um, let's see and current energy for Sagittarius and love So the two of cups reverse with well, the queen of cups reverse uh, Pisces Scorpio Cancer someone that you could be dealing with thinking about but your energy when I was mentioning the indecision of not being able to think of which direction to take of what to do how to move forward that kind of thing of what to say you know um, that's there what to think about a certain situation or someone that energy is there of holding your emotions back bottling them up and uh oftentimes feeling a bit angry and resentful because you don't have an avenue to express yourself of uh, you may feel a bit hurt or someone else is hurt Sagittarius as current energy for Sagittarius we have the eight of Pentacles as you are potentially working you know finding a way to focus that energy that frustration um of not knowing what to really focus on right now after you know some uh, chain of events that actually occurred so this is uh you know focusing on what's on your table what's on your plate uh around the home you know with your job with your loved ones it just depends but this is ambition uh many different projects and things that you may be doing and looking for work or a new job that kind of thing but usually the eight of pentacles means giving in or putting out energy and effort in your love relationship to kind of to get it to work or working on finances as well and that's what i feel for a lot of you out there so let's see current energies for sagittarius one more card for sagittarius current energy for july 2015 love and you have these seven of cups many different options opportunities um you know potentially something didn't work with uh, uh someone you know maybe a a potential romantic partner uh, this could be a job opportunity that you had uh, maybe to work together on something that did not work out uh, Seven of Cups is many options being open to uh, tapping into your creative talents to bring in more money or to 
just communicate with others and maybe you're not ready for that just yet or because of some disappointment and uh, I feel like a lot of you may uh, have that energy of being single right now uh, within the current energy in uh, July all right so let's see uh, the energies as obstacles for Sagittarius for July 2017 obstacles for Sagittarius for July 2017 the Ten of Wands reverse. So it definitely seems to me like there's letting go. There's some moving on. Um, it's hurtful. It's painful for a lot of you. Even if it's uh, whatever you've been holding on to. Resentments, hurts, pains, fears, um, wounds, uh, physical wounds, depression, whatever it is. Uh, letting that go. It could be a divorce. Um, it could have been something that was recent and now you're kind of disappointed that you got into it so quickly a relationship or whatever it may be um letting something go and as an obstacle and this as an obstacle is meaning that you're needing to go ahead and go through with that process and not hold on to it anymore some of you may be holding on the five of cups reversed forgiving you know this is for a lot of you, it may be hard to forgive someone who has let you down, who has hurt you or disappointed you. Forgiving yourself of any kind of, of things that you may have done um, that you need to find forgiveness within yourself. So um, work on that. Try to do your best with that. Obstacles is serious. The Queen of Wands reversed. So this is... Uh, uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, someone that you could be dealing with, thinking about, uh, but this could be your energy as well. Uh, if you have hurt someone, disappointed someone, lied to them, cheated, you know, infidelity, that kind of thing. This is forgiving yourself, trying to let go of holding on to the burden of uh, whatever events that took place in the past. Because they could come back up from someone to address them again, to bring it back up, uh, to throw it in your face, that kind of thing. Or you're doing this to someone else. So uh, this could be you or another person. They could be coming out in this way. It doesn't have to be a fire sign, but anyone in the reverse kind of position, um, they, they're not the happiest of people. All right. So let's see other uh, obstacles for Sagittarius for July 2017. The Four of Wands reverse. That's usually um, an indication of moving, a breakup a marriage instability around the home where there's a lack of communication uh people not paying the bills not having enough money to pay the bills things just falling apart the pets things like that it's just things can be a mess a disorganization and no harmony of being able to help one another out that thing of, of emotional care and sensitivity so these are obstacles things that need to be addressed and turned around if things are to work out um, needing to be able to forgive to move on to let go of things so that you can uh, be on the mend all right so these are in the obstacle position so let's see as advice what we have for you Sagittarius for July 2017 advice Sagittarius for July 2017 the ace of cups is reversed closed off you know you're not wanting to deal with anyone right now uh, potentially maybe turn down an offer you were turned down or someone else is turning you down maybe Pisces, scorpio cancer it just depends i um, mean emotional growth as advice you know um meditation listening to some soothing music fighting time by yourself until you are able to um, allow others to access you until it's safe for them to do so you don't want to force that interaction um, the Eight of Cups reversed. This is staying in a situation that's really bad, you know, continuing to think about the bad things that's not right, you know, crying over the spilt milk kind of thing in a way. Um, usually it's just uh, not addressing something, not approaching something like the Queen of Cups reversed. Uh, maybe this is like a, a revenge thing where you're going to tip for tack with another person. They, they're not speaking to you. You're not speaking to them. Nobody's resolving the issues. But there's tears you know there's still that crying and sadness that's going on nobody wants to face one another or face the issue at hand uh is for Sagittarius for July we have the 
uh, Knight of Wands reverse. So you do have a lot of reversals here, um, but they tell a, a deep story, which is uh, a lot of um, anger, uh, frustration, especially when it comes to making hasty decisions um, and just trying your best to get out of something. And it usually could cause extreme arguments, things being said, thrown around, you know, those kind of things, fights and uh, drama, um, especially if you are dealing with someone who did lead you on or if you did lead someone on. Um, that is uh, trying to mend the situation, walking away from it and st instead of uh, kind of uh, just going round and round in circles and avoiding the uh, complex issue that you could be dealing with. Uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius as maybe a partner or someone that does come in your life every now and then to stir up some trouble. Um, And we have the lovers reversed as well. So yeah, this is <laughs> yeah big deep story here with uh, letting go of something that's not quite uh, working out for uh, some of you. Something that you can't turn around, or something that's uh, potentially just happened um, that you need to deal with and cope with and try to move forward uh, with this. All right. So let's see uh, what the romance angels have for you, uh, Sagittarius. Romance angels energy for Sagittarius advice. Romans, Angels, Bishop Sagittarius, and Love for July 2017. Sagittarius. Codependency, addictions are affecting your romantic life. Sagittarius. Very soon, clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Big decisions looming. Really not sure of what you want, potentially. Um, codependency can mean uh, sexual addictions, addictions to um, the energy of another person, you know, having more than one partner or uh, where you're not independent or someone is dependent upon you. Uh, that kind of thing is potentially going on, uh, you know, being in denial about those things. And let's see, Sagittarius for July 2017, Sagittarius for July 2017. We have heart to heart conversation. Honestly, discuss your feelings with each other. You know, that uh, lack of communication I was talking about, of holding your emotions back, that could cause um, even more delay um, when it comes to how you feel or what you would like to say. So yeah, that needs to happen. That's advice. It doesn't mean that you have to take it, but it's there. So lots of love to you. Tons of healing vibes out your way um, if you do need it. And I do hope that you have a fantastic month, especially with what's going on here. Uh, have a fantastic month. Enjoy.